radian measures and sector area. The diagram represents a yard that has the shape of a square with one corner cut off. A dog's leash is tied to a fence post at one end of the short cut off site. Determine the total area of yard that dog can reach while on 2.2 meter long leash. So that's the figure and this yard is 6 by 6 with this portion cut off, right? 2 by 2 cut off. So if these two sides are 2 by 2, you can always find this angle, right? How much will this angle be? 45 degrees since this is 90. Okay, now a dog is attached here with a leash which is 2.2 meters long. This side will be 2 square root 2, so 2.2 is less than that, right? Therefore, we could draw a circle which a dog could cover, let's say this. So that's the area which we are interested in finding the area of, correct? Now, think like this. Uh, this area has got a radius, this is kind of a circle, sector, with radius of 2.2, correct? Now, if the dog could go all around, then we can find the area of the whole circle and area of the sector will be in ratio of area of the sector depending on of the circle, depending on the angle which through which this is. So basically what we need to find is this particular angle, right? And that is 180 minus this angle, correct? Now, since these two sides are equal, 2 and 2, that angle should be 45 degrees. Correct? If this is 45, this angle should be 180 minus 45. So, we can say that theta through which the dog can go around is equals to 180 degrees minus 45 degrees. Correct? So, which is 135 degrees. So that is the angle with which, along which the dog can roam around in this yard. Now if you compare the area of circle to the area of the sector, they should be in the ratio of these angles, right? So what we are saying is that area of the circle, or we could write anything in the numerator. Let's write sector on the, doesn't matter now. Okay, so let's say sector area of sector over area of circle is equal to the angle by the two have, right? So area of sector, this angle, which is 135 degrees, right? And area of the circle, which is 360 degrees, correct? So we have 360 degrees here. So that's the ratio in which the area will be divided, right? So the ratio of areas is equal to the ratio of the angles. Perfect. Now what is the area of the circle with the radius of 2.2? Area of circle is pi r square. So we can write area of sector is equals to 135 over 360 and this is pi of r square and radius is 2.2 radius is 2.2 square, correct? So we say radius is 2.2. Therefore, pi r square, which is area of the circle, which is area of circle, should be pi times 2.2 square, correct? So that comes in the denominator. So we can find the area of the sector, the total area which we are interested in of the yard that dog can reach while in 2.2 meter long leash. So that is equals to, we can write AS as equals to 135 degrees divided by 360 degrees times pi r square, which is pi times 2.2, let me write like this, okay, pi r square. And we can calculate this value and find our answer. So let's use the calculator. So it gives us 135 divided by 360 times pi times 2.2 square 2.2 square gives us 5.701 and we can write this as 5.7 
meter square, correct? So that is how we can find this area of the sector which is being reached by the dog, correct? So that is the solution. Thank you.